welcome back with another custom rom review for redmi 7 and redmi y3 as well finally we have afterlife projects for redmi 7 and redmi y3 so let's get it started and really thanks to aditya sir for building this one total different user interface something new something special whatever you guys can say this is after labs that means the customization hub and here is the about section and the ui is totally different everywhere you guys will get a different touch okay here we have device redmi 7 android version 13 and afterlife project animation afterlife version 5.0 which is last android security update december 5 2023 build number selenax kernel but i am not satisfied with the kernel uh, since perf here but you guys cry, uh, can try different uh, kernel for Redmi 7 and I will try and let you guys know just join telegram group and here is the different UI of settings at last you guys will get the same system and in system as usual we have uh, every function when you enter you will get system uh, like this animation and UI okay we have device settings that means we can enable MI sound enhancer and headphone types huge collections are there then we have fps overlay ambient display display color calibration clear speaker thermal profiles everything is available here okay then we have safety and emergency password and accounts google security okay let's see what we have in security system uh, we have face unlock and fingerprint and app lock that means all customizations are available here which one you prefer you can use then we have accessibility okay, let me show you that here we have the audio adjustment you can enable combined channels And here we have color and motion you guys can enable or disable animation on a screen okay, let me show you that thing remove animations what happens if you remove the animations here is the animation okay now let me show you that go to accessibility then color and motion then remove the animation just mark it now you won't get any kind of no animations okay if you want to disable animation you can go to accessibility then color and motion under the section okay remove animation that's it then we have the battery UI which is something different I told you earlier everywhere you guys will get different UI and which is really really good and mind-blowing here we have default wallpapers and style basic colors dark theme themed icons icon pack okay some default fonts are there as well and you guys can change the shape of your icons or, or you guys can easily install third-party icon pack easily sound and vibration also this is different and we have power app volume control which is really really good and let me show you this is the ui notification and we have the apps portable hotspot connectivity aeroplane or airplane whatever you say Okay, now let me show you the after lab projects. This is the customizations hub. All necessary things are available here. Before we start, let me show you the CC, that main control center. And this is the control center. And you guys can see a jitterness, but this is nothing you can easily use. This is usable custom ROM. And we have a status bar as usual. We have after life logo, and which I'm using on the top left corner you can enable this and left or right 
the position can be changed is status bar battery customizations also available icon a portrait dotted huge collections are there you guys can easily use that one and battery percentage where you need to show then we have the clock position clock customizations network traffic indicator perfectly working then you guys can also customize status bar padding left right top wherever you want status bar uh, display 5g indicator actually we don't have that feature in that redmi 7 but you guys can use this one show 5g instead of lt that means it's a kind one kind of gimmick actually you guys can enable uh it will show the 5g connection instead of 4g okay actually you will be using 4g connection and the problem with that you guys can enable disable after left style semi greedy style let me show you that and this is the style theme system general you guys can select like this and here we have the themes the status bar quick settings battery under the section of themes we have a status bar we already seen it we have our gesture general and miscellaneous system okay let me show you from system and we have that one default you guys can easily use after left username can be changed high users you guys can add your name here then dashboard style which one you want horizontal style then category preference styles smart eye start icons title all caps title bold whatever you want you guys can select category preference styles and monitor engine uh, you guys can change custom fonts available by default and icon packs all these are previous uh, under 13 features you guys already know about that i don't want to waste your time and let me show you with miscellaneous and unlimited google photos storage and which is pixel xl perfectly working high fps also working no issues with that and android p animation i recommend you guys to enable this one so that you guys can guess uh, smooth animations while opening or closing any kind of applications and then we have the power menu you guys can enable advanced power menu and gestures this is a vanilla build you guys need to install g app separately remember that thing and we have system settings gesture navigation swipe to screenshot everything is working i already checked and here we have the notifications kill app button if you need you can enable mac heads up less annoying color notification icon clear notification button whatever is lighting can be enabled as usual Okay, let me show you that this is the is lighting system you can enable that feature as usual and you guys can change the color accent color notification color wallpaper color which color or custom color whatever you want here is the custom color you guys can pick a color according to your choice okay now let me show you something and which is uh disappointing and which is i'm using here the ajcg cam which already uploaded i made video on it you guys can easily use this is really a good gcam and i already provided some uh xml file as well and in that custom rom this is not working that means no gcam is working here i tried this one not working and i tried this one also not working and tried this one also not working you will not be able to switch anything or it will force close and i think this is uh, due to vendor or some uh, a thing about kernel since perf kernel you guys can change it to default kernel sorry not default kernel you guys can try to install the lineage os kernel so that you can get better things but i will try first and will let you guys know i tried some kernels but that doesn't work okay and then one important thing which is calendar default calendar is missing that means it it's not working calendar that's why i downloaded google calendar and it's fine you guys can uh, replace it no problem and this is cool and let me show you this one and which is cpu throttling 85 percent of its max performance so good no issues and we have by default this dialer and which capable of recording auto calls here you guys can see auto call recording is working perfectly no problem with that 
and default cam is google camera go and another one is this normal local camera app or you guys can't use gcam for now and this is the control center which is totally different and you guys can customize it click on their particular section and we have hues tiles available in that one which is something different and you guys can scroll it like this left right just like this so this is the ua and i think this is attractive and you guys can easily use and we have the game space you guys can enable all that features which you prefer when playing games and safety net pass by default so you guys don't need to worry about it you guys can easily any yeah easily use any kind of banking application or something and first of all you can face some issues with video playing in youtube first of all you can face black screen after uh, one minute watching of the video but i recommend you keep watching the video again and again and after some time it will be fixed automatically that that's not a big issue okay that's the solution and if I miss anything, just let me know in the comment section below. So thank you for watching.